Before we get into this, let me preference this with I love seeing happy relationships. Something about seeing people happy makes me happy. Unless it's my crush. Tom Holland, Zendaya, I cannot wait for them to break up. And it's like, I'm not even really hating. Like, after they break up, Tom, I wish the absolute best for you. Still not the best Spider-Man, but you can be the best best man at me and Zay Zay's wedding. Trust me, the honeymoon won't be far from home. I can never be that guy, though, that intervenes in someone else's relationship just to get with the girl that they want. Yeah, for more reasons, it's wrong, blah, 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 blah. But there's a famous quote that goes, the same way you get your shorty is the same way you lose your shorty. So let's say you do finesse your crush from her boyfriend. As soon as she's yours, the 10 male friends that she still got around are gonna look a little different to you. Like you're not even dating her, bro. You just made the team. So in order for me to not ruin the image I got of shorty in my head, I do the only thing I can do, which is wait. See, in high school, if I ever wanted a girl and she was in a relationship, bro, just give it like two months. High schoolers, middle schoolers shoot adults we all don't know what we're doing if something goes wrong it's over at least that's what i thought until i reached spotsylvania middle school my homie at the time we'll just call him duke because he had more shorties on his body than bill cosby after a house party and his job as my homie is basically to give me the entire rundown of the school and things of that nature this is our school bathroom you're allowed to come in here but if you actually use one of the stalls we gotta fry you and things of that nature this is our lunch table the cooler you are the farther up top you sit if you sit on this end of the table tch, boy ain't no way boy tch, boy ain't no way <laughs> tch, 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 tch. so boom under this bleacher is like where all the girls like yeah type shit you know what i'm saying i don't even need to know side note was my middle school the only one that was on timing like that i don't know if all middle schools were like that but yeah duke had knowledge like this dude knew everything about every person place or thing in sight so one day when me and duke were in gym class there was this girl cute blonde blue eyes mad freckles i could tell just by looking at her just by looking into her eyes that she sat at the top of the lunch table so i'm like yo 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 who who is that duke's like boy don't even try boy she been dating her boyfriend since fifth grade thousand and i remember thinking to myself that eh, they gonna break up in like three months tops bro they dated my entire sixth grade year seventh grade year my eighth grade year freshman year sophomore year junior year and my senior year by the time i got to the end of high school i low-key started rooting for them like maybe just maybe you actually can find love in your younger years oh he cheated on her and she found out through her friends oh and you're telling me that it was with a girl that was less attractive than her too that's crazy and I shouldn't be telling this information to tens of thousands of people on YouTube for my personal benefit? <laughs> Apparently, he got caught cheating on her right at the finish line that is high school. At least that's what I heard. And honestly, GG's. Like, bro was the star athlete at our school, and he held it down for, like, what, seven years? Me back then was trying to get with old girl, but me now, I'd rather hang with Jada. I, I mean, I'd rather hang with her boyfriend respectfully. <laughs> Silly me, I got the cheaters' names mixed up. After they broke up, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't slide too soon, okay? I gotta give her his face. The rule of thumb is that however much months somebody dated their ex significant other, that's as much weeks as you gotta give them to heal. But also, I was awaiting 19.32 months, like what I look like. Soon as Shorty posted something on Instagram where she looked mildly happy, Dame, Steph, and Clay have nothing on me. I'm pulling from half like I'm built for this. And literally, as soon as she replied, I immediately lost our interest in her. But Stanley, you liked her for eight years yeah but like we didn't really communicate all eight of these years after a certain time i may have liked the idea of dating her more than i actually liked her i think there's only one thing that's guaranteed when you wait that long and it's changed i changed the girl changed the relationship she was in changed and my feelings changed do i think it's a good idea to wait absolutely not if the person you like somehow ends up single over time that's when you go steph curry clay thompson but actually waiting for them is crazy i'm not gonna lie to you however if you do find somebody in life one day who is worth waiting for just make sure it's not zendaya y'all can have everybody else zendaya's mine though <laughs> y'all be safe though i'ma catch up <laughs> yo y'all made it to the end of the video make sure you guys like comment subscribe do that all down below make sure you guys follow me on instagram and i hope you guys enjoyed the video me and zay zay we about to go on a little date date you feel me so with that being said it's a wrap fade to black